Welcome to Nutrition by Jules, bringing you all things wellness for your pregnancy and postpartum journey. I'm Jules, and this is my daughter. You want to say your name? No. This is Hilda, and we're going to show you a snack that is super easy, but fun, because we get to put goodies on top. So we're just going to do peanut butter crackers. Just a cracker, peanut butter on it, but... And these are the toppings. Yeah, so we've picked some fun things to add a little um, pizzazz to our peanut butter crackers and also to help make them a little more nutritionally sound, right? So good variety of fun things to put on top. So you want to tell them what we have? Okay, what's this one? Blueberries. Blueberries. Mangoes. Raisins. Raisins. Almonds. Almonds and a... Banana. You can do any variety of toppings you want. We don't have any vegetables on here, but that would also be an option. I love um, eating peppers and peanut butter. And speaking of fun combinations like peppers and peanut butter, not only is this a great one for toddlers and yourself as a mom, but pregnancy as well. So uh, especially during that third trimester, trying to get in more food because you're hungry, but your stomach doesn't quite have the same capacity um, due to that baby taking up a lot of space in your belly. This is a great quick one just to add in some good nutrition. Um, and it's got a good crunch and who doesn't love peanut butter? I am just using a basic round cracker today. How many do we want to make? Five. Whoa, okay. So one, two, three, four, five. Uh, you can do this with a Ritz, with a multigrain, with a Triscuit. I don't know. I'm throwing out brands, but any cracker doesn't matter. Will do. As well as any brand of peanut butter. If you're allergic to peanut butter, or you want more variety, you could also do any kind of nut butter, like almond butter. Yeah. So we like almond butter, and we like cashew butter, all sorts of different kinds. All right. So I'm going to spread some peanut butter on these crackers. Ah. Uh, scooping some out, about a, a teaspoon, and I'm going to spread it on there, and then Hilda is going to pick her toppings to put on top. All right, so we've got one with blueberries. We're getting one with some almonds. So crackers are great for that quick carbohydrate source to give you energy. We're going to get all sorts of, again, variety from the fruits and the nuts or the vegetables that we're putting on top. And nut butters are going to have that variety of protein and fat that's gonna help keep us full and satisfied. Very well balanced snack happening here. Again, toddlers, moms, dads, <laughs> pregnancy or not. And as you can see, it's an easy one for your kiddos to help out with. Should we do a fourth one with mangoes on it? Yeah. Okay, cracker number four. When, when I have something on it, it's really yummy. It is fun. Yeah. Yeah. We got one almond, one blueberry, one raisin, and one mango. Which one are you going to eat first? Should we make a banana one too? Okay. And we're making a fifth after all. Okay, you want to cut the banana slices? Okay. Okay, here's your knife. There you go. Here, I'll hold the banana and you can push down. Here's our five crackers that we just made. Hilda wants to point out we've got Blueberry, raisin, mango, almond, and banana. Which one are you going to eat first? Mmm, blueberry one. Good choice. Which one should I eat? The raisin one? Cheers, Mom. 